we're continuing on with our quote from Malala Yousafzai or any historical figure or character from your curriculum or your classroom, we're going to start by using the black arrow, the selection tool, just to select, hold, shift and select the other parts of this face and just move them down just to give her a slightly different view. Then using the white arrow, the direct selection tool, I'm going to select the edge of this line and just move this scarf over. Make that a slightly better line. Now working with our text, you can double select to bring the text tool or over to the palette on the left, you have your type tool to select in here. I'm going to hold shift and press return on my keyboard to take each of these phrases down to a line of their own to better match the way you might read that quote. Back to my selection tool to drag the text box out. Double click to take it back to the T text tool. I'm going to select this last part and cut from that text box, which is Command X on my keyboard or up under edit menu, you'll see to cut and it'll also tell you the shortcuts. So I'm going to cut and put that in a separate box, just to paste into there. The advantage of this means that you can actually edit and change this text on its own. I think I'm also going to take the world out and give that a separate box as well. Okay, I'm going to select both of these pieces of text up to my character panel. Give it a bit of a bolder font to emphasize those a little bit more and take them up a little bit larger. Using my text tool or double click to just space these out a little and try to mimic the curve around Malala's head. Just gives this a little bit more association with the character so that you connect the two together and assume that they're words that she's spoken. Okay, using the text tool drawing a box over here, I'm going to do some quote marks, select and highlight those back up to my character panel, give you something like times, which gives us those nice curved versions, cut that one out over here, next to the quote at the beginning, and pop this one down at the end. Then I'm going to select and highlight the word change, and, and reuse the colour from Malala's scarf to connect the character even more to the words that we're reading. And lastly, using the text tool, just make this a smaller font. It's really important that we attribute the author. And we're just going to add the year in there. It was 2013 at the United Nations Youth Assembly where these words were spoken. We'll just make that a little bit smaller and give that a more formal look. Now going up to File, we're going to Save As. Save this as an Illustrator file as a copy for yourself. OK. Then File, Export, Export As, and Save as a JPEG, making sure you choose RGB, Color Profile, that you can share with other people. And there's an inspiring quote for your classroom.